Hello everyone, welcome back. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to rebuild WMI. If you have issues with SCCM client is not installing or having some kind of WMI issues, so you can rebuild a WMI. Let's start with going to the folders of where the WMI is. Should be under C drive, Windows, System 32. Oops. Should be System 32. And it's under WebM, W B E M. W B E M. WBEM and then repository. So the folder is repository. You have to delete this folder or rename it by click on rename. You go to just call this old. It will give me an error because it the service needs to be stopped first. Let's stop the uh, W. WMI service. Let's go to control panel and go to computer management. And then under services, service. Let's go into Windows Management Instrumentation Service. It should be this one here. Windows Management Instrumentation. You want to right click and then go to Stop. Click Yes. Now let's go back to this folder and rename it. Call this dot all. Now the folder has been renamed. To create a new repository folder, you have to restart the service. The repository folder should get created. Let's refresh. It's going to take a few seconds. I guess probably it's going to take a few minutes. It should already restart it. Let's see, refresh. Okay, started running. There it is. So it takes less than a minute, maybe 30 seconds. So here's the folder and the contents. Should been created off as well. So that's it. That's how you rebuild WMI. Now you can start. Uh, you can uh, rerun the SCCM client setup. Thank you for watching, and have a good day.